So here is our first piece of cut fossil soup. We got a lot of fossil soup. As you can see, there's a lot of amazing fossils inside this. A lot of crinoid pieces and everything like that. This is from Michigan, and we're just cutting it open to see how beautiful it looks <laughs> on the inside. Oh gosh, look at this down here. What is that? There's so much going on in here. I am not an expert or anything, really in anything, but definitely not an expert in fossils. But you gotta let me know if you know about some of the pieces that are in here, like this guy on the first cut, this stuff, oh man, so cool. This would be really, really fun. Looks like there's some potential like coral or something over here. It'd be really fun to look at this under a microscope. Might have to get a microscope, that'd be fun. <laughs> well, let me cut a few of these smaller pieces. I will not look at them. I will wait to show you so we can see them for the first time ever together. I am so, so excited to see inside these. The fun thing about these is how quick they cut. Boy, oh boy, they cut quick. This one is jam-packed. Oh, sweet. Yeah, <laughs> I love it. I love when you can get faces inside them. That was, I cut one of these once and there's multiple faces in it. We got one right there. That is so sweet. Oh no, it's a sad face. <laughs> oh, that is sweet. Man, these are so cool. And you know, they look so similar, but you know, if you think about it, every one of these pieces is individually unique. There's no two the same. It's so fun, so cool. This one is really, really cool looking on the outside, so. Oh, I thought there'd be more on the inside. That is strange. Oh, that is so cool. A little star. That is really, really unique. Gosh, that little star pattern. That is, <laughs> you know, nature is supposed to be without straight lines, perfect circles. What about stars? We see it all the time in nature, though, don't we? Pretty grand absolutely awesome i didn't see any faces in this one not really and i think this one is su suction together i think this one's amazing oh my gosh that is so so vibrant like that right there it looks like a spine or something like all this stuff in there man that is so cool so so cool wow that's one of those things you could just you know you could just look at for a long time and get lost in it it's like a where's waldo yep that is really really sweet and the last one here that we cut of this batch we got more to cut is this guy right here go oh wow Look at that. I wish I knew more about this stuff to explain it. Oh, that is so sweet. So, 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 so cool. I'm looking for a little smiley or frowny faces. There's like a cyclops right there, kind of off, but. <laughs> That's so cool. Okay, so, and to kind of change it up just a little bit, um, I also have three of these guys 
And I'm not exactly sure what these are. I feel like I heard something like ancient sea lilies or something like that. If you know the exact ID on it, leave a comment. Let me know. Let us all know. But yeah, this stuff, it's, I don't think it's the same as fossil soup. But it's really, really pretty looking. So we're going to cut this open as well. And I also want to say I got all of this stuff from my man Dutch quite a while ago. I've wanted to cut it for a very long time. But now we're finally getting to it. So thanks for being patient, Dutch. And thank you so much for sending this over for all of us to cut. So let's cut uh, these two. We'll see what they look like. If there's nothing inside, I don't want to cut this one because this thing is so so beautiful so i'm kind of hesitant to cut this one but we have a couple more of those traditional fossil soups that we can't cut so let's go Man alive, my my hands are absolutely freezing. So cold. It's like 40 degrees out here. <laughs> well, I'm having fun either way. I hope you're having fun too. If you are, leave a thumbs up, hit that subscribe or follow button. We have a lot of fun cutting coming up, rock hunting, polishing, all that good stuff. So, oh, interesting. It's pretty, but it's subtle. You know what I mean? Man alive. This dog I have, he's everywhere. He's not even near me. How does it happen? He's a good boy. Almost looks like an old piece of art. Very cool. Very, very, not what I expected. Oh. Subtle, but pretty. <laughs> I'm thinking about that other piece now. I am going to leave it. I'm not going to cut it. It's so pretty as is. So I'm going to leave it. I don't want to touch this one. I've learned my lesson a few times where I'm like, oh, this is cut. It. And then it was like, ah, oh, shoot, I shouldn't have cut it. I'm going to leave this one. We still have a few more cuts. That guy. Mega soup. Biggest fossil soup I've ever cut. Hopefully it's sweet. I'm sure it will be. But yeah, these little sea lilies or whatever the heck they're actually called. Pretty in their subtle little way. They look better on the outside than the inside in my opinion. But yeah, let's cut this guy and see what's going on inside that. Gotta cut more stuff like this. It takes less than a minute to cut. <laughs> it's so nice. Oh, get out of here. That is so cool. What is that stuff? Looks like some, this stuff in over here reminds me of like the way that the exterior of some corals look like that I've found. So much going on in that. So fun. Little face, kind of like a hmm. Love the faces, so fun. But folks, one more big cut, the mega cut. This is awesome, so cool. Let's do it. Our final cut, oh, ho, ho, ho. I mean, you can tell it's gonna be packed down in there. It's just like stuffed in the matrix and everything. So let's unsuction this thing. Oh, there we go. Oh my gosh, it's a graveyard. Oh man, that is sweet. Kind of like layers of it. And then it's like not much and then there's more. Little boat tie in there, a couple boat ties. So 
So much going on. Very, very sweet. Definitely, I'd say this is one of my favorites right here. And then this one right here, I think was, I don't know, just, I think it's the color and everything in there. It's just really, really great. So cool. Really like that. Anyway, anyway, we got a lot of good cuts. A lot of good cuts. So, that one was a little bland compared to the others, but still fun. Really great. Another big thank you to Dutch for sending over this fossil soup from Michigan, USA. I hope you all enjoyed this unique cutting video. I had a blast. I cut all this on my 10 inch high tech diamond saw with the thin center blade, toothless. <laughs> it went super great. Hmm. Anyway, I hope you all love the video. I loved cutting all this stuff. Thank you so much for watching.